Hey guys, Kevin here from Network of Tech, and today I'm bringing you a really cool video. This is how to overclock your iPhone or iPod Touch so the processor runs at its full capacity. All right, so first you're going to go into Cydia. Go to search. And you're going to type in iFile. So. Okay. I have the sinful iPhone repo added, so I have the full version. But if you were normally getting this, you just click on regular iFile. Go to the top right. It would say install. So you would install that. Like I said, I already have it installed from the sinful iPhone repo. All right, so after you have that installed, you are going to have an icon that says iFile, and it looks just like that icon right there. So click on iFile. And I already did this, so it's here. So you're going to go all the way back. You're going to find System. Click on System, Library. And scroll down until you find whoops. Okay. So you're going to go into system, the library. We're going to go into system configuration, and you're going to scroll down until you find power management bundle. Click on that. And then there's going to be com.apple, and then the file, that plist. You're going to click on the little blue arrow. Okay, so if you don't click on the arrow, this comes up, just click cancel. Make sure you hit the arrow. And at the top, you're going to click on name. And before plist, you're going to add BAK. So it'll look like this. Dot plist. Click on, and then after that, you're going to click done. Oh man! Well, that is my uh, mobile notif mobile notifier. It's a really cool application. I'll have a tutorial on how to get that shortly. So you're going to click done. Go back to your home screen. Hold on the power button. restart your phone or iPod, and then your iPod will be overclocked and will be running at its full capacity. All right, thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to comment, rate, and subscribe. See ya.